Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're going to be doing our practice for our final exam question. It's called the Alien Periodic Table. This is a classic thought experiment. It helps understand, helps us understand a lot more about the periodic table. So let's take a look at what we're doing. The assumption is that we have just made contact with aliens, actual alien photograph, and they are interested in buying elements from us because on their planet they only have elements from the first three periods, only some from period four and only four from period five. They have absolutely no transition metals and no rare earth elements. So all they have are periods one, two, three, the first two groups in period four, these groups in period four, and then just a couple, one, two, three, four of period five. So things that's, well, it's slim pickings at any rate. So this is the elements they have, and what we need to do to start trade with them is to figure out which of our elements are which of their elements, because they call them something totally different. So here's the way this experiment works. There's a series of, series of clues we get in working with the aliens, and we have to use our knowledge of the periodic table to analyze and break down what they call hydrogen, what they call helium, and so on. So let's get started. The noble gases are bomble, wobble, gyptum, and logon. So the first thing we need to know is which are the noble gases. So look at our periodic table that we made up. We see, okay, noble gases, that's orange. There they are. Okay, so helium, neon, argon, and krypton. There they are. Those are the ones that are the noble gases. Bobel is a noble gas, but it does not have eight valence electrons. Now, we wrote the valence electron number down. Let's see. Helium's two, neon's eight, argon's eight, and krypton's eight. So, it's got to be helium. So, we say, all right, well, that's pretty easy. They call helium bumble. The outermost energy level of logon is the second shell. Well, we know that the period number tells you how many energy levels they have. So, logon must be neon, because that's the noble gas in the second shell. So that one's logon. Of all the noble gases, wobble has the greatest weight, greatest atomic weight. Well, as you go down the periodic table, the elements get heavier. So krypton must be wobble. So that's wobble. Now there's one left, and its name is probably going to be gyptum, so by process of elimination, we know that. So that's the thought process, how you go down using your knowledge and using your clues. There's a back, so make sure you do that. There's another actual alien picture, by the way. I've got a demonstration here for you that goes through the explanation I just went through with you, so you see how to work it. So folks, using your colored and periodic table and the alien periodic table, and the clues, you need to label and identify what all of their elements are called so we can then communicate with them. All right, go back and get started.